gearing up for a test ride. These staff and students at Otago Polytechnic are checking out electric bikes on campus as part of a sustainability strategy. And so we're looking at ways of how we can reduce our impact um, in a lot of things. Um, and so one of the things that we look at is um, looking at the operations of this Polytech and how we can do things a little bit better. So we really wanted just to give people the opportunity to ride these bicycles, see what it's like. The Polytechnic wants to reduce its impact on the earth and set an example for other local organisations to follow. Staff see the introduction of alternative transport as a way to cut down on the campus carbon footprint. It's something they're hoping will become more commonplace. Could we have a policy where um, we're going to encourage people to buy electric bikes and share them on campus? I mean, these are just all random ideas. Or could we, you know, potentially have, have them here on campus for students and staff to ride to their meetings or to other parts of the campus? Life Cycles is a New Zealand-based electric bike company which has teamed up with the Polytechnic. The business creates cycles that are similar to regular bikes, except they're battery charged and speed is adjusted on the dial. They are power assisted, so you turn the power on and start pedalling and there's a magnetic mechanism inside that once you start pedalling you get this little whoosh comes in behind and you feel the assistance come through. Both the Polytechnic and Life Cycles have the common goal of making the city more sustainable. This two day trial is seen as a small step towards a larger transport strategy on campus. Annabelle Dick, 39 Dunedin News.